Chimela, welcome to another episode of Unscripted. My name is Matawe Matapula. Our guest today is Naima K. She's always been working with the late Robbie Malinga on all her albums. So this is the first time she's on her own, doing it by herself, without Uba Robbie Malinga. Uh, welcome, uh, Naima K. How are you? Thanks so much. I'm good. How are you? I'm all right. Uh, tell us, how did you deal with the, with the loss? I know it, uh, it affected you. How did you, you deal with the loss of losing Uba Robbie Malinga? Uh, Mina and Uba Robbie Malinga were too close. Because I think it's a scary movie. Why is it scary? That's what I mean. That's why I said to Nara Pulu that Nancy called me if he's really so that's why I said when I was scary, so he used to call me scary. Uh, Shona Baki, uh, Bumpata Kabi Kapul, Kapul, Bumpata Kapul, is a couple of Christmas funding. I was so much as traveling, I was living in it, but I couldn't even go a car here because it was too like emotional for me. I was only Tata Kahi because in a sense of women performing at the David James Festival. So, yeah, being on stage with him. Kakuba Nandi Kakulu performing our song together because he wrote the song for me. Why in Tanana and Listen G? Why did I see me in the deck by me as Naima Naimoma? I'll go on to me in Jana. So being on stage with him, you know, then you come like Kakulu Kakulu because Miss Fanny is so too. Yes, I say this is music. Magic. I understand that you are currently in studio cooking your fourth album, and this time you are determined that you don't want to feature anybody because Uba Brobi Ayeko. How is that? Uh, how did you decide that? Uh, we can't see if we have collaborated with uh, anyone for the album Lena, because in front of you, we in Doyami, because I'm thinking of calling it uh, uh, Queen K. Yeah, so we be in the day we be done in nine more. So yeah, going up Kunzi, my cousin, he used to write songs for me, and we were trying to save our meeting season. I say studio, so Kunzi, my cool with marriage, I say we end in his marriage album. But okay, we start from Jx, Jx is always like. So this will be your first album without him. Yes. And when are you releasing the album? Um, hopefully end of September. Yeah, but the single uh so the buzzer to uh in two weeks time. In two weeks time, yeah. We also understand that uh I mean uh you based in Devon. Uh tell us do you find it difficult to, to get more gigs, to get more work because you are based at Devon or do you find it difficult or is Justin J Indo that people are saying when you are based at Devon and you've not moved to Johannesburg, you don't have as much jobs as they, they will have in Johannesburg. Is there such a thing? Okay, um, in Durban, in the book of the call, in the seventh of forty, yeah. Yes, because I'm being like time because he's in the club now. Since he doing is more closer, a time because yeah, I'm from Pochette. So, Kulula, whenever I'm not doing anything, very child. But in here, we the decision yeah, we will have next to home is who go. Yeah, because. And you drive and ask these cars. Many fun and when whenever I feel like driving home, very shy more than you can even. What is it about your girl? You're apparently like this. Same what's up with no girl. Yeah, I I love her so much. I could so yeah na. That's like a sister who looks so five a kind of so. I could so go go and just so okay. So she's like, oh my, my girl. Because I was very, very young when I was So, yeah. I was a mother and a father. And I was a That's why I have a good you saying you might call your next upcoming album uh, Queen K. Are you changing your name from Naima K to Queen K? No, 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 no. Uh, 
Kona bata la ubiza Queen K since una yima K. So Queen K, so that's why not. I want me na ubiza Queen K because yimi na ngeto and collaborating with I didn't collaborate with anyone. So yeah. The music that you are doing now different from your previous three albums. Are we going to be getting the new Naima K on this one? What kind of music or sound are we going to be getting? Uh, it's still the same sound. Uh, I'm sure that I'm cool since I have a lot of followers who are part of the music. So yeah, I'm trying to cool, but Kunis into English into to say is in charge of as well as now because uh, on this album, Kukone Ingo Ma A, like Tribal House. So yeah, in Genze, I'm going to sing or Sasa Boy because between the two, Sasa Boy is so cute. But now I'm still trying to cool because I know it's going to be a lot of music. I'm going to be in English now, so I'm still going to deliver the same. Love life, we hear that you are so in love. Who's the lucky guy? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Putting <laughs> you on the spot. <laughs> well, yeah, it's a Yeah, I'm happy. Can we expect wedding balls? No, no, no. 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 No, you're not good to talk in marriage. I'm full of shit. No, I'm not tired. I I I I can't be content with shit. No, I don't lie. I I look good. So yeah. All right. Uh, thank you so much. That was Naima K. You heard her nickname, Iskebengu. So let's wait for for more music from Iskebengu. We're talking about Brown Malinga. Hopefully, she's not gonna disappoint. Thank you so much. Thank you.